Now, your KSBW weather forecast with meteorologist Holt Hanley. Good evening. Well, we had quite a day across the central coast. This is the Santa Cruz Beach Boardwalk camera. Would have been a great day to go out there. Santa Cruz is actually in the 70s and overall just above average temperatures. The warmest temperature was in Greenfield. You guys got up to 77 today. And it looks like the warm air and all that sunshine should be continuing, although there are some changes in the long range forecast. Temperatures right now though, starting to cool off. Looks like we're back into the mid 50s. And then that is warmer than we were at this time yesterday. Not a big surprise because we did have pretty significant warm up this afternoon. We will still see some of those cool temperatures overnight, but it shouldn't be as cold as last night. Now, forecast highs across the state tomorrow, very similar story to what we had today, where the coast and the Central Valley, right in the mid 60s to a few low 70s working its way in there, warmer than you would expect for this time of the year. And then the mountains, still nice and cool up there, which is great for all those skiers and snowboarders. The trend moving forward looks like it's relatively flat over the next few days when it comes to those temperatures. But then towards the middle of next week and then getting into your Thanksgiving holiday, we start to see this high build in. And what does that mean for Thanksgiving? That just means more sunshine, more warm air. Great for all your travel plans out there. Not seeing any big storm moving in that could complicate things. Now, that was about right now to five days out. If we look six to 10 days out, this is the average for the West Coast. That red color just represents more of that warm air is expected. Then if we look at precipitation, because the first question you might ask is, when is the next storm going to come in? It does look like in that long range forecast, again, still six to 10 days out, we do have an above average chance at some rainfall. Right now, it looks like next Saturday and Sunday, we could have a shot of picking up a few hundreds, but at this point, that's still so far out in the forecast that we'll just kind of have to wait and see what happens there. Tomorrow, though, it's going to be a very similar pattern to what we had today. You notice that offshore flow basically just pushes all of those clouds off of the coast. There is some rain off on the Pacific, but the high is you know, blocking that for us, and we're just going to have a nice, another sunny day for California. Now tonight, it will still be cool out there, a little patchy frost, and especially the lower Salinas Valley, that's where it's typically the coolest, 36 for King City. Coast should be back into the 40s though. Last night, we're actually in the 30s in places like San Cruz and Monterey. Then tomorrow, sunshine, 65 to 74. Pretty nice to see that during this time of the year. Light winds throughout the entire day. And then when it comes to those forecast highs, Great to see some 70s back into the forecast. Watsonville, you were warm today, expected to be at 73 tomorrow. And then in the eight day forecast, not much change over the next five days, just that steady warming trend through Thanksgiving. And then we'll have to keep an eye on next weekend to see if some of that rainfall could come through for us.